Hey YouTube, Last Exile here, and we are back with our little Let's Play. And this is our sixth episode. Um, first of all, um, huge thanks to Mason Casey, who has told us what a tax year is. If you want to find out yourself, just go to the previous video. And you'll just look at the comic section, pretty much. It's actually nice to see there's someone else watching my show besides a family member, just so they have the opportunity to point and laugh at it, which is actually, you know, pretty good news. And let's get into it. Um, okay, I've decided to do this miscellaneous quest, which is find Emirates Family Sword, simply because... It is one of those quests where there is either a time limit or you have to do it before a certain level. And you know, we got it there. Might as well just do it. And there it I used to be an adventurer like you. And I took an arrow in the knee. Right. Mister, could you spare a coin? No. Okay, so... Did you raise your prices, Carlotta? Oh, wait until we get out of town before I talk to you. Just give me a sec. And I'm definitely overweight. Okay, so essentially, this is how I'm going to do it. I'm going to do a quest. Then I'm going to try and get another mod up and running. And yeah, we'll see how we go. Like at the moment, I did choose a mod to do, which is the, uh, oh, what was it again? I had it written down, I would have lost it. So it's a bit of a mess at the moment. I'm right ah. behind you. All right, yeah. I decided to pick the uh, Black Ridge Railroad. For the mod, but I'm apparently got to do some stuff before you can actually get to it. And I sort of only just found that out recently, so we'll get to it eventually. We just gotta do this, and then I'll try and figure out how to get down to the train. Okay. Also, if you're wondering why I haven't been on as often as I have been before, simply for two reasons. Number one. You know, I just had some trouble with the new year. And secondly, because I got another character that I'm currently, you know, checking the mods on. Which is a good thing I did, because like, I originally uh, picked out um, Cerise's um, Alchemy Shack as a mod to do, but it conflicts with my... with the... Um, Man, those borders mod. So because of that, you know, we can't have them both running at the same time. So I'm using my other character to test the mods. Now, I haven't had to been able to test the uh, Black Reach mod yet on it. But I have tested a few other mods, so that should be able to help out. So Black Reach Train, check out. That's later on. And the other mod I picked, like again, this little mod showcase and this show is just to pick out mods that have been on there for a while. You know, whether they're still on the Xbox and whether or not they still hold up to today's standards. What the heck was... I I always forget to do this. I've got your back. Yeah, please, yeah. Okay, as you all remember, I've got the ATF mod, which essentially just need modify characters a bit. And it's a good thing because she uses the dragon breath. You know, the dragon breath shout. Which absolutely sucks for me because every single time she uses it, it just throws everything everywhere. I'll follow. Now let's try and find that wolf wherever it went to. Yeah, stuff it.
Okay, just go up here. And there's the cave. Bad time to get lost, friend. <laughs> oh, gotta level up. Okay, now they're dead. Alright, let's have a look if they got anything interesting after we just Oops, wrong button again. Check what we should do. Alright. I reckon we should whack it into stamina since we're so unfit. And oh, that's what else? Uh, enchanting. Yeah, whack a point into enchanting. Yep. And yeah, that's good. We're all good skis. You realize that your life. You have been coasting along as if you were in a dream. Suddenly facing the trials of the last few days, you have come alive. Right. That's nice. Alright, wine, pie, grilled chicken breasts. Okay. Alright, today's question today. Are you a breast man or a legs man? And by that, I mean the chickens... You know, what do you prefer to eat, not what do you prefer to see on a chick? Note from Rudolph. Okay, Rudolph. Your little stunt tried my patience. I know my uncle has issues, but he is our watchman and you will respect him. No more sneaking in and out. No more games with his ledger or nails in his chair. One more joke and you'll see how funny... A day in the cage can be. A job. Job? I don't know how to pronounce this shit. I'll well, take the knife, take the armor, and we've got to help. Oh, wait, what's that? Is that a, uh. Pure short storage note? That's the favorites. Ah, here it is. Yep. Iron, iron short spear. Let's just take that out. Yeah, it's one thing I like about these short spears, they can wield with the shield. But the normal spears, however, though, nah. Okay, so look what we got here. Apples, salt, tomatoes. Got a bucket. You know, it just grab everything. Let's face it, I am a hoarder. It's in my blood. Seriously, it's genetic. You just see the amount of stuff my family has collected over the years. I mean, like, my father for a time had, like, three or four Land Rovers. Series 3 models. Now, what we get? Gold and lockpicks. I've got your back. Okay, you just do the cooking, and I'll do the cleaning. What is it, Dad? Oh, look. Oh. There he is. Good, couple of potatoes. And tomatoes. I've got your back. Yeah, I heard you before. Okay, let's go in there. Sneak mode. Let's see who's there. Alright. Now we'll just sneak right through. Huh? Who's there? Rodolph? Is that you? Yeah. Boss was looking for you. Said he'd be up at the summit. Better not keep him waiting. Okay. And now he thinks we're his friend. Oh, 
I'll come down here later and steal all this stuff. Just concentrate on. Just getting through this joint. Oh, let's get all the stuff on the way back through. So you win? Yeah. You can't have that many huh? eyed fool as our watchman. Even if he is Mars uncle. Time you dealt with Damn. Luckily, we got Alicia here, our mule, tank, and kick-ass woman. That's how it be a silver hatchet. I mean, steel hatchet, steel hatchet. Uh, short sword, yeah, about the same. But we used the hatch for a bit, just to show the animation. Just like the average axe. Now, I know there's probably people going there going, Ugh, grab the staff! But again, I got the challenge with Nauru, which is no fast travel, so unless I'm dropping stuff off. And let's face it, we want to get through this thing, you know, so we're not, you know, fart assing around. You think it'll work? Of course not. Dogs I could train, but a half starved wolf. Not a chance. Right. Lucky if it doesn't rip our throats out. Okay. Let's see if Lucky over there is hungry. What was that? What was that? Over here! I'm gonna get you open! Oh well. Must have run off. Run off. What an idiot. Oh. Someone there? Yep. Time to end this little game. Mercy. No mercy. This axe to the face. Okay. Now before we no, I'm going to save because I want to get that stuff in there. And I don't know if I'm strong enough to survive the fall. So we can make a jump. Ow! <coughs> Missed it. Now, if you're quick enough, you can actually just get the stuff and, like, be suspended in midair for a bit. Again, just get all this shit. Alright, also, I like suggestions on what to do next after this. Like, first thing I'll be doing is, you know, probably the first step into trying to get to the Underground Railroad at Blackreach. Then after that, you know, what other quests you want me to do. But again, please, no mod suggestions, because i got a whole list of mods I want to check out. Yeah, like, just want to, you know, just check those out first. Maybe later on, you know, after I've checked out a couple. That's... Meet the boss. Okay. Swords in there. Huh? Too late like to sneak. Alright. Lucky. How the heck is he still alive? Alright, let's have a look what we got on him. We got the steel. Hey, is it pronounced glaive? Yeah, the steel glaive, which is a two handed weapon, a bow, iron hand gauntlets. Could we use? Gold, Havar's journal, 
is just you know, a couple of pages. Like, I'm not going to read this one. I'm just going to go. You know, if you want to pause and read it, I'll give you guys enough ample time. It's just four pages. Okay, iron armor. Wait, what was that cloak? Wait. Wrong button again. Now we got the a fur cloak. Right, looking snazzy. Now that's more suited for Skyrim, given how current cold climate. Huh? Again, let's just get everything we can. Okay. Warhammer, coin purse. And there it is, Emran's family sword. Nothing unique about it, it's just your standard iron sword. As to how he can tell the difference, I got no idea. Seriously, they could have just done an option to where you, as an evil person, just given just an ordinary iron sword and said, hey, here it is. Got it. Iron shield of resist fire. Increase fire resistance by 15%. Alright, that's good. That's good. Gold necklace. And staff of zombies. Alright. And we're over encumbered. Alright. First thing first, we'll just fill around a bit. Got a one. Alright, what am I going in there for? Where's that shield? There it is. My shield of heat resistance. Okay, I'm going to take a moment to put all my stuff into Alicia. And then we will, you know, just still here. Loot all the stuff in the cabin. Okay, I'll be back in a sec. Okay, and we are back. We've transferred all our stuff, and now Alicia has changed some of her armor automatically, and looked like a million bucks. And if you're wondering why we don't have the a helmet on her, it's essentially because we get some blocking issues. You know, where like part of her head seems to stick out through the helmet, and we got the horns. But uh, I like the hairstyle, so we're just gonna you know, keep her as is. But now, now it's just to try to time just to pick up the rest. Uh, if you guys want to skip ahead, you can. I'll... So all we're just doing is just looting all the stuff we missed on the way back through. And we finally got our pickaxe. Means... Good old mining. Okay. Alright, the reason why I am sort of filming this is just to show you guys, you know, I'm not cheating, I'm not using the cheats or anything, I gotta you know, follow the rules of the challenge. But if you guys want to bring up like a little mini challenge or anything for me, again, just put a comment in the most recent one, again, first um, comment gets it, and then I'll let you know when we're up for the next challenge. But no, first thing is what it is, you know, it's, you know, first come, first serve, uh, best dress, you know, all that, you know, who's on first crap. Couple of sacks of flour, fly mana. Healing potion and an imp. Alicia. And it's one thing I don't like about the companions, and that is they tend to become roadblocks when it comes to the doors. Like, have you guys noticed that? 
boots, fine clothes. But no, no real unique items through here. Like sometimes you get the odd one or two. Clothes iron. Girl's red dress. You know what, there's probably a couple of children's things and the mods that we're using, so we'll pick that up anyway. Wood plate and blue robes. Explore Skyrim's Guide. You know what? You can probably pick up most of these books on, you know, YouTube or, you know, something like that. Or maybe Wiki. Yep. Yeah. You know, what's the Skyrim Wiki? What's the name of that? Uh, Wiki Dover or something like that? I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, probably the Bethesda website or something. So if you guys want to read, you know, the books and that sort of stuff, or the, you know... You know, why am I telling you guys this? You know, go out and find the books yourselves. Why is this... I'm right behind you. Cake and the Diamond. I think that's a little GTA reference. I'm right behind you. You're right in front of me. You know, what? You know when I finish this episode, I'm going to tweak through the options. Maybe I can do something that. Makes us stop talking a bit, because, let's face it, she's starting to sound like a bit of a broken record. Back down here again, again, flour, nice tankards, wine. I've got your back. I've got your back. Okay, now we're gonna take your potatoes, your tankard, and your book, which... Okay. Oh, by the way, I killed your nephew. Get a whoops from one again. Yeah, juniper berries. Weakness to fire. Great. Imperials are really cool. Bullshit. And that's it. All we got to do now is just go back to White Run. Again, just for Nauru, I got to do all of it all the way. Little torch bug. <laughs> Why 
What the? Hey, look at that. Flying club. I'm right behind you. All right. Not every day you see that. Finally, the front door. Where does he live? Oh, he's in here. At the Drunken Huntsman. I think there's a redneck joke in there somewhere. Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. If not, let me know. I might have it stored away. Yeah, it's over here, mate. Sometimes I miss the soldier's life, but when I hold my daughter in my arms, I know I made the right choice. I have your sword. You found it. I've been looking for that blade for months. You took on all those bandits yourself? Thank you. Here, my father had a favorite sword and shield technique. Let me teach it to you in honor of his memory. All right. Thanks for that. Ah, oh, and block. Wait. Now that quest is completed. And yep, we're gonna end the episode right we here. Bows, arrows, and ale. A unique combination to be sure. Okay, that's nice. We'll go out here. But no, essentially I'm right behind you. Yeah, I know. And it's gonna scare me. But, nah, like, essentially enough, that's our sixth episode, which is getting Amory sword and bringing it back down. And with that over and done with, we're going to end it right here. Remember, tomorrow we're going to try and figure out how to get into Blackreach so we can get to the train. Train mod, and, uh, whoop, on the button. And, uh, yeah, hopefully we should have a good go at that. I'll, uh... See you all next time. And again, just a quick apology for, you know, going through all that long ass stuff. We're picking up everything. Again, it's just so Nuru can see I'm not cheating. Alright, have a good one.